Did you know that 70% of the population have eye floaters? So what are eye floaters? And maybe you've experienced them. They're like those little wiggly wormy things you see in your eye when you are looking at you know, a white surface. And I, this is something I've actually suffered with myself since I was like three, but that's another reason. But this is um, outside that. Okay, so for those of you who don't know me, my name is Belinda, and I'm very passionate about helping people pinpoint what is causing their sleeping issues, their energy issues, their hormonal imbalances, okay? Uh, their weight problems and so, so much more, okay? But did you know that 70% of the population actually suffer from eye floaters? which is crazy, right? It makes you wonder, you know, they're not, they're not, they don't actually harm us, they're just annoying. And I know this from personal experience um, because when I was younger, I actually had a kid throw sand in my eye <laughs> and I've had them my whole entire life, okay? And it can be really frustrating when you're reading or looking at white surfaces or even just outside in the sun, you see these little, little squiggly things, okay? But they're just a sort of thing that drift in your eye. And, you know, they're not dangerous, they're just really annoying, okay? But what they are actually is collagen fibers, okay? They're a buildup of a protein. And, you know, what can happen is that when we have diabetes, we can actually get more of these, okay? Uh, when we have inflammation in the body, we actually get more of these, okay? As we get older, okay, aging, can cause 90% of these, which is insane, right? Okay, also infections can actually create this as well. So what do we actually do about it? Okay, but there are certain things that we can try. There are no real um, scientific studies on this, but one thing that has come up that can actually help people with this is actually intermittent fasting. Okay, whether it be a 24 hour, 48 hour, 72 hour fast, people have recorded uh, having some influence on this. But once again, it's not dangerous, it's just bloody annoying, okay? So anyway, if you have this, why not let us know down below, okay? I'm curious to see how many people actually suffer from this because this is something that I have had my entire life. Anyway, you have an awesome day and I'll see you tomorrow.